We call VIT more a family than a university. As Silvam pointed out, once you join, then you are going to be a leader in the future. VIT started 37 years ago as a small institution, an affiliated college to the University of Madras. And uh, now, as it was pointed out by our Vice Chancellor and co Vice Chancellor, we have grown into a big university, one among the best universities in the country. In fact, among the private, we are number one. We have about 1,000 universities in India, about 600 government universities and 400 private universities. And uh, in everything, in all parameters, we are number one. As it was pointed out, we have gone for the fourth cycle of NAC accreditation. There are only 10 institutions in India, 10 uh, universities out of 1,000 have gone for fourth cycle of NAC accreditation, and uh, we are the highest among the 10 institutions. Uh, it's not that uh, we want to say that we are the only institution which is coming up. There are a number of them are coming up. But the advantage of joining EIT is that it is a national institution and an international institution. I don't know how many of you are aware, you may go to many colleges and universities, but it will be dominated by the local people or one or two states nearby. Vellore attracts students from all parts of India and all parts of the globe. This year alone, I find students from 33 states and union territories have joined in the first year BTEC program. And we have uh, 18 programs. We have attracted students from 33 states and union territories. And um, uh, nearly 40% or 30% are girls. And uh, we have foreign students this year alone, as it was pointed out, we have students from more than 50 countries. And uh, this year, we have students from 22 countries of the world. In fact, the top countries are among the top five is uh, UAE, USA, Oman, Saudi Arabia, and Kuwait. I find I have been watching the students coming from other states always I take interest. And uh, this year, I find some of the states have overtaken others. For example, we used to have um, Rajasthan before as number four or five. Now it has been going back, it is number 11, but uh, Uttar Pradesh has taken the lead next to Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, fourth is Maharashtra, fifth is Karnataka, Kerala, Telangana, Bihar and Delhi, West Bengal. These are the top 10 states, uh, which has 10 students. Of course, all the other states also there are representatives of our group. I want to tell you this because once you join VIT, you are a national, you are becoming a, a national institute, part of the national institution and the international institution because ultimately we want this country to come up in the world level. Always our Prime Minister says that we should become a $5 trillion economy. It is possible, it's not impossible. Only thing is, we have to concentrate on education. That's what VIT aims at. We want to educate as many people as possible, from poor families, rural families, middle class, everywhere. And ultimately, once we invest in education, it will lead to the economic development of the nation. If the governments, both the union government as well as the state government spend more, then the families will have to spend less. If the government spends less, then the families have to spend more. That is what is happening in our country. I hope in the future they will realize, the governments will realize the importance of education, particularly higher education, and spend more. I have been always requesting the government that there are 30 countries in the world where higher education is offered free. So far, we have not thought about it. Of course, we are offering some scholarship to the, some sections of the society. That must happen. Only then, 
all our students will have the uh, opportunity to study. At present, those who are eligible for higher education, among them only a 26 or 27 percent uh, of uh, the opportunity to study in colleges and schools in the higher education. The rest of them are waiting. Uh, I hope a time will come where many of them, whoever wants to study, will get an opportunity. As far as VIT is concerned, I think my previous speakers, my chancellor, Provost chancellor, and others point out that in the ranking, we are very high, not only in the country, even at the world level, we have started coming up. As it was pointed out by my chancellor, in the Shanghai ranking, they took 1,000 universities in the world. Out of 1,000, only 14 came from India. 14 were selected from India. And among the 14, we are the only private institution, only private university. There are three IITs above us, uh, Delhi, uh, Karakpur, and Madras. The other IITs are behind us. That's how we are growing. But um, we want to compete with others. Uh, for example, our students are there. Once you join VIT, you have your relatives and friends in at least 82 countries, our own students are living. If you want to go any of the other countries, our students will be there. Our alumni is there to welcome you. That's the kind of uh, university you are joining. And we are so happy that um, all the good companies have our students. Uh, in fact, uh, I used to tell the Bank of America, I don't know, Samuel Rajapar must be able to tell us how many of our old students have joined uh, Bank of America. I used to tell people that the, the Bank of America is won by Americans, but run by VITs. That's the kind of students opportunity we have to go to important institutions. And only thing is you should not waste your time. You concentrate. We have all opportunities to grow. If you want to be a sportsman, you can be a sportsman. You have extracurricular, co-curricular activities. We want the overall development of personality of our students, whoever joins here, a boy or a girl. All of you will have all the facilities here. Only thing is, you must be able to utilize them and come up in life. I would like to congratulate the parents for sending their sons and daughters to VIT because once they are here, we will take care of them. We will take care of their academics, we will take care of their health, we will take care of their future. If they want to go for a good job, we will get them. They want to go for higher studies, we are here. Our international office is here to help them to go to good universities with scholarship. This is the kind of uh, protection you have once you enter VIT. I would like to congratulate all those who have joined the big VIT family. Thank you very much. Thanks for